guys welcome back to my channel if you are new thank you so much for joining me my name is Leslie and I like to post lifestyle budgeting and motherhood type of content here on the mother plan so y'all this is part two of our budgeting for today I'm going to be doing our cash stuffing and yes y'all I know it's been a minute since y'all had a cash stuffing from me if you want to know why I'm going to go ahead and link a video right here in the cards above so you'll know why I've been MIA but you girls back we are ready to get back into it so let's go ahead and get started this is $721 and that is for our cash envelopes our sinking funds and our 52 week saving challenge but I need to go ahead and add one more thing and that is our debt snowball challenge so since I've been MIA I have not done the last two cash stuffings for the month of June so I need to go ahead and catch up so what I did already before we started filming I went ahead and picked my numbers not by surprise though just because your girls funds are a little tight I went ahead and pulled the numbers for the debt snowball challenge and they're all right here it ended up being a total of $40, okay? And all I did was just go through all the numbers and pick all the lower numbers, just so I could be able to keep this challenge going and catch up from the previous two paychecks. So we need to pull $40 out of our everyday cash envelopes, and we'll do that now. And as you can hear, I have tons of change because I have not emptied this thing out in a while. So let's do that. Y'all, the sun is going down. We are crunched for time. I don't want to turn my ring light, but I may have to during this video. So that's all the change I have right here. I'm going to just sit this to the side. Okay, so let's find some money. Yes, these are my newest cash envelopes. You guys haven't seen these yet, but this is the Golden Goddess set. Isn't she cute? Just kind of the same variation of the African Beauty set. I just changed up the colors and the hair, but this is what's currently in my wallet. All right, y'all, so I already know I don't have nothing left in groceries just because it is what it is. And I do have $20 in my envelope, but we're gonna skip that. Miscellaneous, I do have money in here, but it's not much, so I think I'm gonna leave that one. Let's see, family fun. I'm gonna take $20 out of family fun. And then I'm gonna take $20 out of the gas envelope. All right, there we go. There is our 40 bucks. So we are good there. I'm gonna add that to my little pal here. So this should be a total of $761. Let's go ahead and count to make sure. Got my calculator here. 50, 100, 150, 200, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 170. 5, 10, 15, 20, 21. $761. We are good to go. Let's go ahead and set up bank and I'll be right back. Don't tell me how you feel. So quiet laying next to me. The silence over me letting you go. lose some of that light it is like 8 15 so I went ahead and cut on the ring light since it was getting dark all right guys here is my everyday wallet I keep all my envelopes in here just for everyday spending if you guys are interested I'll go ahead and leave a link down in the description box so first things first I like to take this out it just makes the stuffing go a little bit easier Okay, so first one is groceries. Groceries is going to get $200. So I'm gonna do two 50s and we'll do five 20s. One, two, three, four, five. So this should be a total of $200. 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 
I'm gonna do it to the side just because I think it looks better that way. All right. Oh, that glare. I'll have to hold it like that. <laughs> okay, y'all, so the glare is bothering me too, okay? It is bothering me too. <sighs> I wish I would have got started just a little bit earlier so we wouldn't have to worry about this, but I'm so sorry. So I'm gonna try my best to hold it so it's not such a bad glare. But the next envelope we have is our spending envelopes for my husband and I. So we're both going to be getting $20. So $20 for him, $20 for me, and I already have $20 in here, so now I have $40. And I'm going to just sit his money to the side because I just give it straight to him. So that one is done. Next up is miscellaneous. Miscellaneous is going to be getting $20 as well. And we do have some money left in here. We have 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. So I'm gonna do, I have a lot of 10s. Hmm, we'll do a 20, cause since we don't have any 20s in there, but I do need to get rid of those 10s. This was all the money I had on hand, y'all, so I had to work with what I had. 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. We have $54 now. Okay, next up is Family Fun. Family Fun is also going to be getting $20. So, I'm going to do... We'll do two tens for this one since it already has plenty of 20s. Now we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95. 95 dollars in our family fund envelope. All right, next up is gas. Gas already has some money in there and we are going to be adding $60. I'm gonna do two 20s and two 10s. There we go. Okay, so now we have 50, 70, 90, 100, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28. 128 dollars. That one is done. This one, y'all, is my child care envelope. And I already have some money in here, so we won't be putting our usual hundred dollars. I'm just going to be doing 50. So I'm going to do Hmm. I'm going to do 20, 40, 50. Just want to break it up a little bit. So now we have 50, 70, 90, 100, 10, 15, 20, 25, 125. And just like that, the everyday envelopes are done. I'm gonna put that back into my wallet. All right, y'all, let's move over to our sinking funds. So I still have my binder here. I know last time we talked, I was like, oh, it's getting so thick. I'm gonna have to switch out my envelopes or get a new binder, all that good stuff. Girl, let me tell you, it went down real quick. <laughs> the month of June was not kind to us, okay? So I had to use some money out of these envelopes. 
I don't have no 1K slips left in any category. So these were the ones I took out. So the biggest one that took a hit was the car maintenance envelope, but it's all good. Um, our car ended up needing more work than I anticipated, so I had to spend a little bit more money there. So, um, you know, things happen. It is what it is. I still have to get tires for my truck, so that's what I'm working on now. So you will see I do have quite a bit still left in here, but if you guys have been following me, you know that this envelope was was thick, okay? So um, we are back down under a thousand, but that's okay. I have a truck, so my tires are gonna be expensive. I'm gonna have to get it, you know, get the whole alignment, all that stuff. So I'm trying to save up maybe $1,500 to get all that done. We shall see. So car maintenance is gonna get 25. I'm gonna do, yeah, we can just do, let me get rid of some of these 10. So I'm gonna do two 10s and a five. Okay, so now we have, One, two, three, four, five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, ninety, nine hundred, nine, ten, nine, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, nine, nineteen in our cart maintenance. So not too bad. A little over five hundred to go. So that one's, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna try to build this one back up, you guys, because I really need to get some tires, like, for sure. I don't wanna have to dip into savings or um, our emergency fund, anything like that, so I'm trying my best to ride it out a little bit, but if the tires start getting real bad, y'all, I'm gonna just have to suck it up. I may pull from another envelope and just get that done. So, we're good there. Okay, home maintenance. We're gonna just add $20 to this one as well. I'm going to get rid of these 10s. There's 10, 20. Add that to the bunch. Now we have 1, 2, 3, 400, 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 439. Okay. Y'all, it's getting darker out there. <laughs> I might have to turn the light up some more. Well, we'll just keep it going. Okay, pet care. Pet care is going to get $10. And then now we have 100, 150, 200, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37. 137. Okay, so Terminex is not going to be getting anything, but let's go ahead and check in with this envelope just to make sure all of our numbers are right. Um, this should be, I think, $222. One, 150, 170, 190, 200, 210, 215, 220, 21, 22. Okay, so we are good there. Back to school. Back to school is not going to get anything, but in this envelope we have 100. <laughs> I'm a little too fast. We have 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. 95, 200, 205. Karate, we are gonna add to this one, I'm gonna add $25. Um, I'm going to do two tens and a five. Okay, now we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 550, 20, 40, 60, 80, and... What is the matter with you? 550, y'all, that 50 is gonna throw me off, and I told y'all I'm rusty. I gotta get back into this, so let's use a calculator, okay? One, two, three, 400, 50, 100, 150, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 5, 10, 15. 
So now we have $7.25 in the karate envelope. Uh oh, my bad. I know I better get my money. Straight fool, y'all hear me? Yeah, that's my husband interrupting my video. Talking about he better get his money. <laughs> All right, next up, birthdays and gifts. This one only has, what's that, $57 in there. So y'all, I'm going to be adding $200. And I know that seems like a lot, but I have my husband's birthday and my daughter's birthday um, this month, actually the same day. And this envelope is lacking for sure. <laughs> so um, I'm going to put the 200 here. And honestly, I think I'm going to have to pull from the vacation envelope because we did not spend all of that money when we, went, when we went on vacation. So I'm gonna be adding some of that money to help me with their birthdays for this month. So let's do that, $200. Here is 150. We'll do 20, 40, 50. So that should be $200, 50, 100, 150. 170, 190, 200. Okay, so I'm gonna add that. Let's see if I can count with these 50s. 50, 100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 240, 250, 255, 56, 57, 257. And I know that's not gonna be enough, but like I said, I'm gonna pull from whatever. I know I'm probably gonna use all of this and then I'll pull from our vacation envelope as well. HOA is not getting anything. Should be like, what, $70 in here, $50? 20, 40, 45, 50, 55. $55 in the HOA. 80, 90, 100. Amazon, I will add $10 to this one because our dues are coming up for this. So now we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85. And our goal is like 119, 120. So I'll be able to put that together by the time it's due. Emergency prep, I'm not gonna add anything to this one, but we have 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 210, 211. We still have 211 in here, and I did use this, y'all. Especially when I wasn't getting any work, I had to dip in there just a little bit, and plus we had a storm coming, so I had to stock up on batteries and waters and all that stuff. So we did pull just a little bit from that envelope. So vacation, so this is the envelope that I said we still have money left over which I was very surprised. We did good, y'all. We did not spend that much, so we have left over in this envelope from our vacation that we took last month. This was before the income issue, so don't, don't come for me in the comments. No, I didn't take a vacation knowing I wasn't gonna get any hours, okay? <laughs> so anyway, we have 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80. So that's 380, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90. We have $390 left in our vacation envelope, which is very, very good. And like I said, I'm gonna probably be using that for the birthdays for this month. All right, so let's move over to our saving challenges. We did pull six numbers because I had to catch up since I didn't do any paycheck stuffings for the month, for the month of June. And I had to pick all the low numbers because I am just struggling a little bit and I needed to catch up. So if I would've pulled all high numbers, it would've been no way. I just already know it would've been no way. So I did pick the numbers myself without you know, doing a surprise pull. So I ended up doing $41 and that was just all of the lower numbers that I could find. So we're going to take, uh-oh. Okay, I was like, wait a minute now, we off, but no, it's not. So I'm gonna do 20, two tens, and this $1 bill that I had down here where you couldn't see. So that is $41 that we we're adding to our 52 week saving challenge. 
And I'm just gonna add that to this. I'm not counting it. We're just adding that to the pile and we will count this later. Okay, so our debt snowball, as you can see, it's pretty empty. <laughs> and that's because, like I said, I didn't do any extra for the month of June. And I had already applied what I had in this envelope for May. So we are going to do the same thing. I end up pulling all the low numbers. And that number ended up being $40 even. And that was six different numbers. So I did the four that I was behind on and I added an extra two. So 20, 30, 40, and then that is going to go here. All right, y'all, that is it. We have stuffed our sinking funds and our cash envelopes. Your girl still stands up, we are good. I am going to update my sinking fund paper off camera, but I'll go ahead and leave the total amount that we have in our sinking funds. I'll go ahead and leave it on the screen, like right here. So that is what we are working with. Remember, we are starting over. I did have to use some money out of these envelopes and we're just gonna keep pushing forward and we're gonna continue to build our sinking funds, which is like a short-term savings. And I'm very grateful that I did have these for the month of June because they came in handy. Y'all just don't know. And y'all, yes, I am still starting a new channel. I will go ahead and I'm gonna leave a link to the channel in the description box or leave it in the comment section. There's no videos on there right now, but if you want to be the first one to know when I post, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to that channel as well. That one is going to be, you know, more me related, more mommy related. I'm gonna be doing all kinds of stuff on that one. So I would love to have you guys join that. It's gonna be some more vlogs, day in the lives. Um, cooking and all my little weight loss recipes and me trying to get together because your girl is struggling just, just, just a little bit a little bit but that's gonna be my journey you know to self love and balancing this thing that we call life so yeah I just needed a place where I can post all of my other content that was not budgeting debt payoff related so you'll still get all the stuff that you like over here on this channel but that'll be for everything else, okay? So, if you're interested, like I said, I'll leave a link down below. If you are new watching this channel, y'all, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, all that good stuff. Show your girl some love so the YouTube algorithm can pick me up. And that is it. I am glad to be back, and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.